How's it guys? Back for leg 6, um, UKFC Bass uh, Social. Um, we are on our way to Buffelspur Dam and uh, hopefully we're not going to get too wet. According to the weather forecast uh, we're going to get quite a bit of rain. With me is my brother-in-law, normally, always with me. In the back seat we've got a new guy, uh, my nephew, uh, Ludic. He's uh, brand new to bass fishing, so we're going to show him a couple of things, show him the ropes, and uh, hopefully he'll uh, catch a couple of fish. So next time we see you, we'll be at Buffelsport, and uh, hopefully we can show you a couple of good fish that we, we're going to catch. See you there. Morning guys, Buffalo Sport Dam just launched and uh, see what uh, we can catch today. Water is uh, extremely clean. Um, we fished a bit last night, but uh, not a lot of fish came out. We did catch a couple, so let's see what the day holds. Um, I'll be back with you guys as soon as we catch something. something what can you do if you only get small ones Better than weighing in nothing at the end of the day, you know. <laughs> Seems like this is the size that I'm going to catch today. <laughs> Man, what a good day. Um, go call your mother. No matter where I go, a small little bass keeps on popping up. Okay, so maybe for the guys that don't know, um, I've had a subscriber make contact with me. Very new into bass fishing and all thing, and I said to him, try a Texas rig. Um, not everybody's always familiar with all the rigs and knots and things like that, but Texas rig, it's a wide, extra wide gap hook. But I have, here's one sixteenth ounce tungsten weight. I've got a, a stopper on it as well. Um, this is a junior fluke, so what I do is insert the hook straight in the middle, right up to the bend, come out straight in the middle of the bait, don't come out skew. Pull it up, turn it around, and it should look like this now. So, the hook is there. So I normally take my fluke, I bend it 90 degrees, and I just stick it in there, it's straight. Then I just expose it, just bury the hook just slightly into the top of the body. Pull the, the stopper down, the gummy, they call it gummy, stoppers, whatever you want to call it. And that is a Texas rig Junior Fluke. And uh, 
Let's see if we can catch a fish. Another very small little fish. <sighs> Man. Don't even measure it, it's too small. Must be what? Right, let's be positive. It's my personal best for today, smallest. <laughs> Cheers. Sure. They only get smaller. Yes. Some type of bait. It's about the size of freaking bass. How's that? Another PB. So, end of the competition, what you've just seen is uh, a very, gives you an indication of how wet our day was. Um, I had to pack up in the rain as well. Um, on the video as well that you just saw, uh, very small bass that came out. Um, yeah, for me, Buffalo Sport has never actually produced anything big for me. Um, Mr. Ludic here in the back. He caught one last night, didn't count for the competition today, he blanked, got a zero, but at least he got a prize and a lucky draw. Uh, Philip got one, uh, got a bag, but only managed to get fifth place. But overall, nice day on the water, very wet, but that's part of fishing. Thanks for watching, see you next time. Cheers.